family and friends out of affection for Amber and Evan. We've gathered today to witness and bless the mutual vows which will unite them in marriage. Amber, words cannot express what this day means to me. Today I am the happiest and luckiest man alive. I found you at one of the lowest times in my life, and since then you have made me a better man, father, and now husband. Couldn't be happier with the mother and fiance you are, and I'm ecstatic I get to spend the rest of my life with you as my wife. Marriage is a massive commitment that I can't wait to enjoy with you. Thank you for everything that you have done and continue to do for our family, friends, and home. My love, our day is finally here. I have thought about this day ever since I fell in love with you. You are my reason why and my soulmate. Today we get to celebrate the love we share with our family and friends. I cannot wait to see you waiting at the end of the aisle for me. You will be the most handsome groom today and forever. You are the joy of my life and I will love you forever, your loving husband, Evan. You are the joy of my life. I love you. Oh, look at you. Aren't you Life with your guidance and wisdom. This walk is going to be my favorite. Thank you for the love and support. this woman to be married to this man. I do. As we gather today to support Amber and Evan in this new chapter in their lives, I'd like to share a quote that they have chosen by Maya Angelou. In all the world, there is no heart for me like yours all the world. There is no love for you like mine. And so it is that we come here today in a celebration and an expression of love. Today I was privileged uh, to be able to walk my precious granddaughter Amber down the aisle and to give her away to Evan. And uh, I can't say how proud I am of, of both of them. I was a substitute for Amber's father, Gary Langdon, who unfortunately was taken from us as a young man many years ago. I'm sure Gary is <clears throat> with us today, looking down, beaming with pride at Amber and Evan. To 
pronounce you husband and wife. Evan, you may now kiss your bride. They bring the fullness of their hearts as a treasure to share with one another. They bring the dreams that bind them together, and they bring that particular personality and spirit, which is uniquely their own, and out of which will grow the reality of their life together. And so let us rejoice with them as an outward symbol of an inward union of hearts, a union created by friendship, respect, and love. I just want to say to Evan that I'm blessed to add him to my family and I wish him and Amber a long and happy and prosperous and fruitful life together and I want to thank all of you for being here today and for helping to make the wedding of Amber and Evan even more special so I thank you and may God bless you Thank you.